Dear learners, today, the focus of my presentation is, concept, need, purpose and scope of in-service teacher education. Let us first try to understand the concept of in-service teacher education. In-service teacher education refers to professional development programs and activities designed for educators who are already in active service. It is a form of continuous learning that occurs after teachers have completed their initial teacher training and have started working in schools or educational institutions. The primary aim is to enhance teachers' skills, update their knowledge, and improve their teaching practices to meet the evolving needs of students and the educational landscape. It is a critical component in ensuring the continuous improvement of education systems and the professional growth of teachers. Need for in-service teacher education 1. Changing educational landscape, educational systems are dynamic, and in-service teacher education helps teachers adapt to changes in curriculum, pedagogy, and assessment methods. 2. Advancements in pedagogy and technology, continuous professional development is crucial to keep teachers abreast of the latest advancements in pedagogical approaches, instructional strategies, and educational technologies. 3. Student diversity. In service education addresses the diverse learning needs of students, including those with different abilities, backgrounds, and learning styles. 4. Research informed practices. It ensures that teachers are informed about current educational research and best practices, allowing them to integrate evidence based strategies into their teaching. 5. Legal and policy changes. Changes in educational laws, policies, and standards necessitate ongoing training to ensure that teachers comply with regulations and deliver high-quality education. 6. Professional growth and career development. In-service education provides opportunities for teachers to grow professionally, pursue leadership roles, and enhance their career prospects. 7. Teacher well-being, supporting teachers in managing stress, promoting work-life balance, and addressing the social and emotional aspects of teaching contributes to overall teacher well-being. Purpose of in-service teacher education 1. Skill enhancement. The primary purpose is to enhance teachers' instructional and classroom management skills, improving their effectiveness in delivering quality education. 2. Professional growth. It fosters continuous professional growth by encouraging teachers to engage in reflective practices, set goals, and pursue advanced qualifications. 3. Adaptation to change. In service education helps teachers adapt to changes in curriculum, teaching methodologies, and educational technologies to meet the evolving needs of students. 4. Addressing educational challenges. Programs may focus on addressing specific educational challenges, such as improving literacy rates, promoting inclusive education, or integrating technology into the curriculum. 5. Fostering innovation. In service education encourages teachers to explore innovative teaching methods, incorporate new technologies, and experiment with creative approaches to enhance the learning experience. 6. Collaborative learning. It promotes a culture of collaborative learning, where teachers can share experiences, exchange ideas, and learn from one another. 7. Meeting professional standards. In service education ensures that teachers meet professional standards and stay informed about ethical practices in teaching. Scope of in service teacher education. 1. Formal workshops and courses. Structured workshops, seminars, and formal courses provide in depth training on specific topics or skills relevant to teaching. 2. Online and blended learning. In service education often includes online courses and blended learning models, allowing teachers to engage in professional development at their own pace and convenience. 3. Mentorship and coaching. Mentorship programs pair experienced teachers with novices, providing ongoing guidance and support. 4. Action research and reflective practices. Teachers engage in action research projects and reflective practices to analyze and improve their teaching methods based on evidence and personal experiences. 5. School-based professional learning communities. Teachers collaborate within their schools in professional learning communities to discuss best practices, share resources, and address common challenges. 6. Specialized training. In service education may include specialized training for teachers working with specific populations, such as English language learners, students with special needs, or gifted students. 
7. Leadership Development Programs may offer leadership development opportunities for teachers interested in taking on leadership roles within schools or educational organizations. Thank you don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, Education and Teacher Education, at Shoking Bilal.